Well, hey guys, welcome to the channel. My name is Derek, and I have a surprise for you. Uh, we used to have Chili come on the channel. We used to call him Sweetie. Uh, most of the most of the videos with him on there, we used to call him Sweetie. Um, you know, I decided not to call him because I thought it was you know disrespectful to call him something he obviously does not want to be called. Um, but he decided to actually come on to the channel today for another interview. Uh, he doesn't have his friend Deborah with him. It's just him. Um, you know, he said he has a lot of things to talk about and, you know, I, I figured, you know, here's the thing, here's the thing, Chili. I, I'm always open for interviews. I'm, I, you know, I always let you have a chance to come up here and, you know, say what you got to say. But, um, yeah, guys, I, I, I've got him on here. I hope you guys give him a chance and let him talk and kind of just, we'll see how the interview goes. So, Chili, since this has been a while, I, you know, I've made some videos about you um, some have been quite uh, cringe, like you would say, and you have said that I was a piece of shit, um, and you know that kind of hurt my feelings a little. I'm not gonna lie, Chili, that hurt my feelings coming from you. And but I forgive you, okay? I do forgive you. But how have you been, buddy? How, how have you been? Well, here's the thing. Here's the thing. I didn't come on this channel to be berated. You know, I only agreed to it because you said you was gonna give me fifty dollars. And, you know, I could really use that $50 right now. Yeah, as you know, as you know, I'm here in Colombia. Or I was in Colombia, but I'm not in Colombia. Because here's the thing, here's the thing. Uh, you know, I did a fundraiser. And, it, and you know what? I, I did a fundraiser. Uh, and, you know, I used that money to go to Colombia. Um, that's what I wanted to do was, you know, I wanted to go to Colombia because my family sent me an email last year. And I was like, hey, you should come to Colombia. And I was like, you know what? I'd love to have some Ray-Ban sunglasses and go to Colombia. So I'm going to raise a, do a fundraiser, get some money, uh, say we're going to use it for legal fees. But, you know, in, in that way, we don't really need money for legal fees. I'm really smart and intellectual, so I don't really need a lawyer. That was, that was kind of direct, dude. Like, I didn't expect you to come off already um, <laughs> explaining yourself. Like, you don't have to explain what you did with your money. Like, a lot of people kind of knew, and that's just my opinion. I don't know. But a lot of people kind of knew what you was doing with that money to begin with. And it is kind of suspect that you decided to go to Columbia um, to see your family after you did a fundraiser. It, I, I don't know. I can't, I can't be, you know, I, I'm trying, trying to be, I don't want to be disrespectful or paint you in a bad light, but it is kind of like suspect. So what, what, what do you think about that? Well, here's the thing. People can say what they want. Uh, there's no victims. There's, there's no victims. They don't exist. I don't have a criminal record. Uh, that doesn't exist. You may, I, I like GHB. Uh, you know, I, I took a diversion program. For my DHB, GHB, and GHB is really good for you, by the way. <coughs> Sorry, uh, just puked in my mouth a little bit. <laughs> Sorry, uh, yeah, I'm just recovering. I broke my tooth, and uh, you know, I'm just trying. You, you know what I mean? Like, uh, just so you know, just so you know. Here's the thing. Here's the thing. A lot of you people come in, and you're like uh, so obsessed with me. You're so obsessed, and you're like. Hey, uh, I, I I think you guys really want to fuck me. That's that's the problem, you know. I, that's the thing. I, how many? How many? Just so you know. Just so you know. <laughs> just just so you know. Just so you know. How many of you guys, especially you, uh, bits and pieces, you you really just want to fuck me? Is that right? I I have have to let you know, Julie. Um, I just got married. Um, I actually have sex. Pretty well, and you, know, you can say what you want. It's like, hey, girl, see, you having sex. Um, you know, I, I, I enjoy uh, having that uh, relationship. Uh, not with you, not with you though. Um, you know, I just mainly because I don't like men. Um, I, you know, I don't want to have sex with a guy, and I don't want to have wieners in my butt or in my mouth. Uh, you can say that's homophobic. It's, it's not. It's just I don't prefer. I prefer you know a vagina compared to a wiener. Um, and you know, I understand that you want me to have sex with you and you want the other people to have sex with you, but you just got to understand you can't be that direct with people. Not everybody wants to have sex with you. I mean, I'm sure there's somebody, uh, you, you know, I don't want to just write you off, but I'm sure there's somebody. 
Well, here's the thing. I'm always open. I, you know, I always told you several times, if I ever come back to Ironton, you're always open to my place or in my van, you know? What, what, whenever I get my van back, um, that is. But here's the thing. Here's the thing. I, you, you're a terrible person. You're horrible. You and the trolls are so bad. Um, you know, you guys just uh, so obsessed with me. And it's because of my high intellect. My, my super high intellect. You guys are not educated. Unlike me, you guys, I'm on another fucking level, okay? I'm a badass motherfucking alpha. Uh, just, just, just so you know. Just so you, <laughs> uh, so, so you know. It's, it, I just said it. It's, it's, it's what I did. I just said it. Uh, but anyways, most of you people don't even know what I'm all about. You know, I have these lawyers come on. And, you know, I'm smarter than most lawyers, uh, just so you know. Okay, <laughs> you know, you know, uh, but anyways, uh, here's the thing. Here's the thing. Let me tell you, I read a book. It was uh, 19 or I'm sorry, 1628. It was called The Little pa the Little Caterpillar That Could by John Glock McGlack. And most of you people probably never heard of it. Uh, but here's the thing. John Glock McGlack, like he told me, he came to me. He teleported from 1632 to me to say, hey, you are Chili De Castro, super high intellect. And this is what he told me. He said, you know what? You're the fucking caterpillar. You can skip the metamorphosis phase and go straight to the butterfly. That's the thing. I'm going to skip the cocoon part. And I'm so educated. I can be the butterfly. I'm the motherfucking butterfly, you know? That's that's what it is. That's what John Glock McGlock said in 1632. Uh, you know, most of you people don't even know because my intellect is so high. You guys probably never read that book before. And, and, you know, if you did, you would have a YouTube channel and you'd get a lot of views. You know, that, that's just the way it is. I, I'm just saying it right now. I'm just saying it right now. Well, I've never heard. I've, I've heard of um, the little caterpillar. The little caterpillar. It could. Sorry, I'm, my education sucks. You know, I, I'm not very educated. Uh, you know, I just have seven years of college and 15, 20, 15 years of experience in IT and graphic design. Uh, but that's, that's beyond the point. It's beyond the point. I, I, I do think that if you have experience and education, which, you know, I do have proof on it. I don't have a degree, but I do have proof of my experience and education. That's, that's why I have a nine to five. Um, and, you know, I, I have a really good job. Um, I, I like to think, uh, you know, I do pretty well at my job and very lucky, very fortunate. Um, but I, I, for some odd reason, it triggers you guys whenever people come out and say, hey, um, I have a job. Why is that? Well, if you was educated, if you was educated like me and, you know, you was able to throw a fundraiser like me, you wouldn't have to have a job. You wouldn't have to have a nine to five. Here, here I am. I am the pinnacle of man. I am what you call the Pam Anderson for gay people. Um, this is the way it is. Whenever John Glock Bagak in 1628 wrote the book, The Little Caterpillar of It Might, he was talking about me. Like, literally, I feel a connection with John Mark Glock, and, you know, he he's great. And, you know... Here's the thing, here's the thing, here's the thing. You guys are troglodytes. A, a lot of you are troglodytes. You guys don't even compare to me. Most of you people want to be me, but you just can't, especially you bits and pieces. You know, you're you're fat. I'm just going to tell you, you're fat, you're, you're a piece of shit, and you have no mission. You have no mission on life. I, I'm just going to tell you. <laughs> there, there it is, there it is. I'm, I'm just going to let you know. Uh, but in, anyways, anyways... Uh, John Glock Bagak in 1612, whenever you wrote The Little Caterpillar That Should or Could, um, you know, it, it, was, it was true. It's true. You can skip the metamorphosis cocoon part and go straight to the motherfucking butterfly. And I'm the king of the butterflies. I'm a fucking monarch. You know, I, you, know you can call me Queen Bee. Like, I mean, King Bee. Uh, because that's just the way it is. Just the way it is, guys. I'm just going to tell you. Um... Because I'm skipping, we, we don't stop, okay? We don't stop. And I'm going to stop all the trolls. And, and here's the thing, here's the thing. Uh, just so you know, uh, you know, I'm going to stop all the trolls. The trolls are, it's all going to end. 
uh, uh, torture cups going to end. Dungeons are going to end. Cops are going to end. Uh, mass hole mafia is going to end. These trolls are gone. I, you know, my intellect is just so high, um, and I'm highly educated. I, I don't have a criminal background. You know, uh, you know, even though I do have a criminal, I, I'm sorry, but even though you know, I, I've never, been, but I've been in jail and I've been in gangs fights. Yeah, but I'm not, you know, I'm not violent, but I am violent. And you're not my daddy, bits and pieces. I'm just going to tell you, you're not my, not not my daddy. Um, and that this is that's the thing. That's the thing. Um, if if you was my daddy, you would have a YouTube channel that people actually watch. And but you know what? You know what? I'm the fucking monarch butterfly. What do you got? Well, that actually kind of hurt my feelings just a little bit, Chili. Uh, actually, did you you struck a chord there, buddy? Um, you know, I've always wanted to be a butterfly. Always have. Like, I, and it sounds like to me. Like you was chosen for this mission by John Clock McGlock. Um, you know, I've never heard of that writer before um, because I'm not educated. I don't I don't have an education. You know, I, I just like I said, I just had 15 years of experience in IT and graphic design and college background in arts and science. Um, but, it, you know, I <laughs> that doesn't count because I don't have a degree. I just have, you know, a mountain of debt due to being in college for years. And I've been about $90,000, I think. But that, that, I'm not educated. Not educated at all. I, I you know, I, it is what it is. Um, you know, and I do have a YouTube channel. Um, and, you know, I, I have over 900 some videos. Not, oh, I'm not that popular. I'm a felled gamer. Um, that is what it is. Uh, but, um, yeah, dude, like, you're totally right. You're totally right. Um, you are the apex butterfly. Um, you know, you, you hold the, you hold the keys uh, you know, I, I wish I could get some new Ray-Bans and go to Columbia, um, but I've never had that chance. I, you know, I, I I would probably use the money for legal fees instead of Columbia, but that's just my opinion. I don't know if you did that or not. Uh, it just seems kind of suspicious that you did. Um, but yeah, why why is it why is it you're you're so so angry all the time? Well, here's the thing why I'm so angry. It's people like you, Troll Mafia, the Irish Demon, uh, Legica Legicator. I'm just going to tell you, bro. You're not even on my level. Not even on my level, at Legicator. Whenever I come to Ashland, Kentucky, I'm going to beat you. I'm going to roll around in butter and flour. And this is what's going to happen. I'm going to roll around in butter and flour. And then I'm going to beat you like eggs. And you know what happens whenever you put eggs, flour, and butter together? They make fucking biscuits. I'm going to make so many biscuits on you, Legicator. So many biscuits. You just wouldn't even believe. It's going to be like fucking Bisquick, but biscuits everywhere. Everywhere. Because I'm the alpha fucking butterfly. Yo, you are uneducated, and I am so smart, and I'm nonviolent, but I'm going to make biscuits on your ass. I'm going to make so many biscuits. It's going to, I'm going to open up a soup kitchen, and it's going to be awesome, and you're not invited to it because I'm going to make so many biscuits on you, Legicator. And, and, and that goes for any other other person. You guys are not on my level. You know, I, I, I'm like Colin McGregor or fucking The Undertaker or, you, you know, even the Fresh Prince of Bel-Air. You know, I like these guys and I that's pure alphaness. And, you know, I am skipping the cocoon part and going straight to the motherfucking butterfly because that's just how it is. And just remember, just remember, I was steaming. Legicator, Team Skeptic, Masshole, I'm going to make so many biscuits. You you don't even understand. Uh, AFA, AFA, I'm going to tell you too. So many biscuits. There's going to be so many. I'm going to beat you guys so hard. So hard. So many eggs. So much flour. So much butter. It's going to be biscuits everywhere. And you're going to have to fucking roll out the, the, a fucking tank because it, it, it's just the way it is. Just the way it is. <laughs> that's that's just the way it is. That's what I just said it. Just just said it. Uh, you guys are disgusting, terrible people. And I'm I'm done. Bits and pieces. This I'm done. I, I'm so done. So done. And if you guys, if if you people don't think I'm, you know, if you don't uh, do as I say when it comes to taking all your videos down. Uh, you know, I you know I I I canceled the lawsuits, but I you know, I can reopen them just as easy, uh, as long as I can get some money. Uh, I can reopen these things, and I may need a little bit of help. And you know, I, I, but you know, yeah, I'm good with money. I'm good with money. But anyways, I'm done. I'm done. I'm done. Go 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 home. 
Uh, I, I'm going to get the flack out of here. <laughs> just so you know, just so you know, that's that's what I'm going to do. So what I'm going to. So see you later, bits and pieces. That was interesting. That was really interesting. He just left. Like he totally just ditched me. Just ditched me. Um, that was unprofessional. Uh, a lot of things was said there, and I can tell that it was an anger. And you know, we got we got to realize, poor Chili. Um, he is skipping the cocoon phase and going straight to the butterfly. Um, and now that we know that we can find a book by John Clock McLock called the little pa little caterpillar that could i can't even say the name right because i'm not educated enough and i'm sure we're not we don't have enough intellect to really do these things but um chili is gone uh, i'm sure he'll be back whenever he wants more attention uh, until then guys thank you so much for watching i definitely appreciate it feel free to hit that follow button and subscribe and i love you